Alrighty, so hi everybody, and back on again, and time for some more pinball. Um, to start with, there may be a potential chat problem. I was having a, I was having trouble trying to get uh, my Twitch chat up and running, so it, uh, it shows on my uh, my 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 screen. Um, so it, I'll probably look. I'll probably have to look at it from time to time, like especially if uh, if it doesn't show anything, because uh, like I said, uh, it might be uh, malfunctioning today. Uh, but otherwise, not a whole lot. Um, not a whole lot going on. I think I said most of what I wanted to say out yesterday. So, um, yeah, I, I there was a there was something I was wanting to talk about. Uh, but I don't want to. I don't want to risk a crash and go BS in the process. So I'll go ahead. And, uh, I'll just go ahead and leave it alone. So, but anyway, I'll, anyway, probably just gonna be the usual. Um, I'm doing FX3. I'll probably take a look at the matchups. Unless I got dropped down, like, way out of the green. I don't see it happening. Um, I'll probably skip matchups. And then, um, just after that, doing the journeys. Do that for a while. Um, switching to randos. Um, then after that, switching on over to, uh, Pinball Arcade. And you guys know the drill. Oh. Paragon. Uh, oh, and the uh, the music. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to. It's Zomber or Proy. The Tai Epic. Yeah, it's it's another French album. Here, let me tell you what. Let me do this real quick. If that helps at all. So yeah, um, but otherwise, hope just hoping for another uh, another good session like yesterday. Just had a, I only had like one major dip in a uh, pinball arcade, but the rest of the session. Let me get my uh, fan on the floor here real quick. Let me get a few more preparations and like usual, I'm gonna have some cottage cheese as well. Dropped down to 17th. Uh oh. Skate ball? That one sounds familiar. Yeah, I've seen this. Um, I think uh, I think I watched a tutorial video on this. Fairly popular. Uh, 4,000 of them are made. Nineteen eighty? I thought it came out in like nineteen ninety or something like that. But apparently not.
Oh, damn. They're one of the lucky ones, huh? set things up. And already I'm calling bullshit. So... 1.09 billion? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Dummy Cry and Haxer is on this one. my doubts are number one uh number two i guess as well three and four uh, i'd like to see replay videos in those two um at one billion i highly doubt it i don't think even all the uh, all the other sussy score or even all the sussy scores i've seen um uh, from other players don't don't compare to that one never seen never seen a score on that table with uh 1 billion in survival mode Guess it didn't do a whole lot of tournaments yesterday. I fucked up. There it goes. I'll strike one.
Strike two. Oh, strike three. So I gotta avoid hitting that green shot. And the ball goes out anyway. place on that one. Does that? Lamp dick. This one. None are going to get hit. There it goes, down the drain. Yep, down the drain. Yeah. 
Kodiak is in dire need of a facelift. The adult has improved. It's not your lucky day, folks. Okay. It's just a scratch. Whirly bird ready. Let's soften him up. Bombs away. God, I hate the way these balls look. Oh, there goes one. Shot slip, not gonna hit. And the ball goes out anyway. You'd be so much better at this. Oh, hey, let me go, let me go. Somebody already got 118 million on this. Yeah, well, I did. No. It would take me five minutes just to get multi-ball going. Ain't gonna be getting much on this one. Hit that green shot.
Yeah. Only in my dream world. Or only in my dreams. Shot eater. Shot eater. So much for that. Ah, shot slip, not gonna hit. Told you. mill. That's it. Maybe an extra ball could give you extra time. Two. Not one, but two. Oh, wait, this is the one I think I saw yesterday. Yeah, same guy. 1.4 billion on one ball. Yeah, definitely crying bullshit on that one.
No? Um... Sure, I got it. No, but I wish they would. I've been saying it for years. I wish, uh... FX3 would do what, uh... A lot of other fighting games do, you know. I think Guilty Gear does it. Street Fighter 4 does it. But I can't see why, uh... A game like Street Fighter 6 would do it, but... It automatically records all of your matches. FX3 needs it too. It automatically records all of your, uh, all of your, all of your, um, your table runs, especially your tournament ones. It's probably one of the reasons why I see this so much. Because. They can they can do this with no accountability. So the most uh the most they could probably say is, well if you know what you're doing, you can get a huge score in this. That's that's pretty much gonna be their only argument. Which okay, fair enough, but one point nine billion on one ball? Or whatever that was. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure they still do that at casinos these days. Like if somebody gets like the million dollar jackpot, you know, pull the slot machine and it's all bars. I think um I think they actually had detain you. They'll like take you downstairs and interrogate you and stuff like that, or they'll you know, put your hands on the wall and they'll like frisk you and stuff to make sure you're not carrying any anything used for cheating. Duh. Yeah, but tilting's kind of its own punishment too, I mean. Yeah, I I don't think this game has a report feature. Yeah, you can't uh Yeah, I can't I can't interact with these at all. Tears. I don't want no mates. There's just too many captains on this island. I'll catch this bird for you, but it ain't gonna be easy. There's one! Get it! That is some good aiming, Chief. Other than that one skill shot. That's not very nice. Hey, watch it. This is my ship. Now lock the ball. You got that one locked, all right. So, apparently that didn't give me another ball, so. I'll catch this bird for you, but it ain't gonna be easy. Nice shot. Sure wish I can go up that ramp.
Fuck. thing End of the mod. Wasting score boost. The ball. That's not very nice. Hey, watch it. So ten million. Suck an ass on the turnies. It's official. You will yes. suck. Thirty billion on normal mode. Yeah. Let me call him bullshit on that one. Somebody actually did worse than me. Not gonna bother, not when the ball drains that quick. <sighs> Got 
Got some slim pickings. journey has begun. The caravan arrived to a small town. Awesome. Ball saved. Big cards. Well, fuck that up. Bull saved. Enter the cave of wonder. True love protects you.
No. Oh. Oh. Catch the ball. Oh, so much for that. Oh, dump light. Doing a lot of driving around, huh? The caravan arrived to a small town. Nice shot. Magnificent. The caravan has been attacked. Hey, the guards! Hey, the guards! A lot of good that did. What are you studying, if you don't mind my asking? Oh, turn your heads. Driving skills.
Oh, damn, okay. Yep, single file down the fucking middle. Won't stop trying to fucking drain anyway. So yeah, doing so good, and then all of a sudden it just went to shit. Surprisingly, I got third. Okay, what won this time? So I'm assuming that, uh, you're hoping for a career in civil engineering then? Call white. He already had, he already does. He picks a lot, so. Guess it falls to me. Um, so since we were on the subject of trucking at some since we were on the subject of trucking or truck driving, I'll pick our red and Ted's. When I actually make it to multi ball, I'll have to kill the uh, table music. way to start.
Should have brought more than one t shirt. I knew I should have brought more than one t shirt. Straight down the middle. Alert. Watch for that. Oh, 
Hey, Babs. All right, I got up. Oh, nice girl. be able to turn the music back on now. Looks like that's gonna do it for me. Yep. Yep. That's gonna do it. Oh, just barely. And I'm out of score boost. Do it. We're rolling now. I'm always rolling, baby. 
but not too bad. Kind of like that part of Forrest Gump where like all those shrimp companies are like out of business except for Forrest Gump's. Bubba Gump's ramp. It's a household name. Devil use some work. Gotta spend five minutes doing nothing but draining. in a ramp. Um, I can't play Pinball FX. My uh, computer can't handle it. I think I remember me trying one time. Or FX3, okay.
Get a boy. And a ramp. Hey, pal. Head for the ramp. Oh. Shot lit. Not going ahead. Yup. Alright, it's in a ramp. Oh, I'm not even trying to get back up. Uh, how to get back up there? I think I broke a mill. Ah! Uh, somebody else must have sniped a huge score. Oh, 1.7. Yeah. Unfortunately, it's pretty much the only shot I could do. Oh, damn. That's a good tournament. You guys can't see it, but uh, all the scores are close. <sighs> okay, so technically this table has copyrighted music on it. So, which means you're gonna, have, you're gonna have to deal with some dead silence on this one. That malfunctioning little toy. This is all his fault. Oh, better luck next time. to make that shot.
Seem to be made to suffer. How interesting. Now, where are you taking me? This is such a drag. It's a nightmare. I like the extra ball at the sinkhole, Arthur. Ouch. I intend to do That's uh, doing. And uh, you can uh, get a good chunk of points uh, over there, too. Keep hitting that uh, that saucer. Random reward. And you'll often get uh, you'll often get extra ball. And on this table here, Extra balls give you what one million. Does the ground feel stable to you after all? Now where are you taking me? This is such a I'm brand. taking you down the drain. So much for that. Yep, so much for that. Damn. Yeah. That's the tournament run exactly. Could have gone the distance. Oh. I bet it was a 
Surprise. There's something wrong. Yeah, I guess I shouldn't have bothered. Shouldn't have bothered. Just barely. Nope. Didn't budget much. Oh, I dicked it. That action got it. Went right by me. Second chance. Five million.
close out anyway. Score boost. So, something that very rarely happens on this table, getting multi-ball. Of course, I have to actually make the shot, though. She's in one of the tunnels. We gotta find her. And we can't have a multi-ball that ends as quickly as it begins. Just like that, so that's it for multi-ball. Yeah, and I probably won't hit the uh, snack bar. I'm probably not gonna hit the snack bar now. Well, how about that? from out of nowhere. Five million. Oh, that's that on that. Gotta love not having a tilt on here. Gotta start making that shot. squat out of that one. Five 
five million. Oh, right by me. Hey, that's gonna do it. Million. Well, I think it's the best I ever done on a survival mode on this table. Wish I knew more. Wish I knew what my rank was. Oh, damn. Yeah, took first. At least for the moment. You mean half a billion? <laughs> surprised I haven't seen that. I'm surprised I haven't seen that score yet on here. Like, 500 billion? Thanks, Babs. What frickin' time? Pretty sussy here. Someone did get um eight billion though, on the same exact mode survival. So and then compared to uh, second place, which is only six hundred fifty-eight million. So yeah, need to see a replay on this one. Still in first. Yeah, still in first. Uh, only, only four players right now. Yeah. Cell phone's trying to shut off. Is 
Shot eater. Yeah, here we go. 60, 60 seconds of only hitting that, that saucer. Yeah. Locked on target. Missiles on standby. Or that one. <sighs> Once again. Not to mention if you um, if you get that saucer hole, especially when it's lit, the clock still runs, so. Goes one. Oh, shot eater. Got it. Got it. Oh, baby. Sometimes I wish I could do a John Madden impression. Get the troops ready. <laughs> Use the atomic blaster now. We must save the Brandenburg and Tour. Gotta head for the loops. Hopefully, nope, guess not. Nope, wasn't enough. So, the clock still ticks when you destroy a UFO, so it's one of the reasons why I have to avoid that shot, but... Sure wish I could hit that left loop. I just have to settle for a lesser multi ball. Okay. <laughs> multi -ball! Is your dog snoring?
Sure wish I could hit that right loop. I wish I could hit that right loop. Oh, so much for that. Finally. Yeah, that sucked. You cannot defeat our force field. I just noticed that, Jack Knot. So apparently there's no John Madden boom on the soundboard. No John Madden on here. That's all I got. Or I should say, that's all it has. Oh. oh. Appreciate you sticking around, Taku. Potentially that uh that also assumes that uh I don't screw up the multi balls on it.
Um, yeah, attack for what it's worth. Um, I what? I wasn't full-time streaming pinball for eight years or anything like that. For the longest time, um, or I should say, when I first started streaming, I think I only stream pinball once a week. That's it. It's too, it's too fucking frustrating. So, and then it got to a point where, um, I wouldn't even stream it at all. For a, for a very long time, I stopped streaming it, and then I would, at the most, I would uh, once a week I would record one short session, like between 15, 30 minutes, and that's it. Just to keep my uh, stress level in check. But, um, I will... Ace high. Sounds familiar. But, um, I will say this, Taku. Um, much of what kicks your ass on pinball is not RNG. It's not randomness. It's, it's geometric, or geometry and physics so but yeah I used I used to think that too because but once you uh once you start learning flipper skills and stuff like that then uh, you'll you'll realize less and less that it's not really that much RNG RNG it's also one of the reasons why uh, I pretty much stream pinball full time these days um I think you were around for about five or so years, I used to only stream Gems of War. But it just... It just got, um... It got to a point where... Too much ran too much randomness in that game. Because you could have the, uh... You can use the best team and You can use the best team in the entire game, and there's still gonna be times... You're still gonna be fucked. You know, you gotta sit there and... You gotta watch your own team get decimated because you cast an ability that actually backfired on you and you have to you gotta sit sit back and watch yourself slowly lose especially in PvP yeah Paragon that was that was in my transition period I think I know what you're talking about. I used to... I would stream pinball for a while until around 2 a.m. Kill it entirely and then switch over and do a Gems of War stream. But... It's actually kind of a... Kind of a role reversal with those two games now. Again, I used to... I used to only... Uh, do like a... Sh record a short session of pinball once a week. But, uh... And then... Stream uh, Gems of War full time. Now, now it's the flip side. Hell, I don't even um, I don't even stream gems. Of, I don't stream gems of war anymore. I don't record a session. The most I do on that is just do like the dailies and stuff like that. I think I did a, I did a video some time ago about uh, why I only stream pinball nowadays. Yeah. But, and then also for what it's worth too, I've loved pinball ever since childhood. Let me get out of this. But I've loved pinball ever since childhood. So it just... It just something my I guess love at first sight. So... This, this isn't... It wasn't... This wasn't something that 
I trained myself to like or anything like that. So the attraction was immediate. But that's not that's not something you could say about every other single person. Yeah, these days I'm pretty much uh, I'm burnt out on just about every genre out there. I mean, my favorite genre is actually uh, RPGs, RPGs in general, but I can't really get into them anymore. Um, I also like idle games, but again, I'm not really not really much into those anymore. I did I did uh, stream Summoners War for a while, but that game there is too graphics heavy. My computer can't handle it. Or it it kind of can, but I can't I can't stream it because it's too it's uh too much for my computer being in two places at once, you know having to having to keep the stream going and the game going as well. Yeah, yeah. I think um accountability. Again, I mean, I fuck up a lot on pinball, but a lot of it. That's just on me. So, it's more of a more of a skill-based game. Fighting games are kind of like that, but uh, I didn't. I don't. I don't take to fighting games that much. More than uh, more than like some other people. The most I, as far as fighting games go, go, especially as far as playing actual other human players goes, I prefer playing players that like that are like right around my skill level, or uh, or uh, people that I know. Yeah. Yeah, we all do. I think it's... There was something else I was wanting to say about that. I think it's one of the few, uh... It's one of the few games I can think of where, uh... That's true even of the pros as well. Um... Whereas, you know, games like RuneScape, ultimately, that game is just a grind. I mean, you know, maxing out all your skills on the on that game is, is pretty impressive. But, uh, but at the core, that just means, all that means is you've grinded more than anybody else. And it just, it gets predictable, you know, you, you go to the same area, you go to the same, you go to the same area in that world to train such and such skill, you just keep doing that over and over and over and over and over and over and over. It's like a routine. It's one of the things I like about uh, pinball and I guess fighting games as well. They're mostly skill based. It's not a routine. You can have a great you can have a great game one moment, just totally kick ass and take names. And then other games, like what you guys saw what you guys just saw on Attack from Mars, I totally botched and fucked up the total annihilation multi ball. So you can have those as well, and that's um, that's something, even the pros, even the pinball pros go through that. It ain't just it ain't just the beginners. I mean, granted, the pros are gonna be more fundamentally sound. They're probably gonna be able to stay at that table longer, cause they got a better grasp of things than a beginner does. But that's not to say that uh, they're gonna be on that table forever in a day or anything like that. And they. And they most certainly aren't going to get 
32 billion on one fucking ball on fishtails either. So, yeah. Um, whereas fighting games, not so much. Uh, you could have a. You could have you could have legendary players like Justin Wong, Punk, Nephew. Um, I can't remember his name. It's a white guy. He looks like a white suburbanite. Wish I knew his name. But you, but I've seen guy, those guys there. They can build up like 30, 40 win streaks. All of them you know, playing against human players. So it's like they got it down to a got it down to a freaking science. You don't you don't see a whole lot of that on on a, on pinball. Okay, so I guess um, since I'm at a good stopping point right now, yeah, I gotta break off for a few. I gotta use the bathroom and guess I'll put what little is left of my cottage cheese in the fridge since it's uh pretty much warm right now. Oh, and um. I'll have to, I'll have to chase it down. The name of the album is... my controller and cell phone on the charger. Okay. And then, um, and then when I come back, um, I'll probably just uh, start on randos. I'll be back.
Alrighty, so let's do some randos. And not a good way to start. Look at that. One guy gets through. Keep on shooting. No luck, sire. The world is shaking. Chain it up. Lamp deck. Much for that. Fine marksmanship, son. The world is shaking. No luck, sire. Lamp deck. Don't do that. Yeah, I know. Free me, Gareth. The world is shaking. Get him, sir. Oh. Lamp dick. Fuck. Perfect. Oh. Don't surprise me.
Yeah, probably. I'm guessing they're probably not gonna do anything to FX3. Like, no updates or nothing. I guess technically technically I beat my previous Um I'm guessing not Yeah, I hadn't tried that one. But uh if it's anything like uh FX, probably not. Computer pro my computer probably wouldn't be able to handle it. Best case scenario, I wouldn't be able to stream it. I might be able to play it. But uh that's that's about it and that the all the graphic settings are gonna have to be set to the lowest. Um It's basically an entry-level uh, gaming computer. I have a... I upgraded my uh, graphics card on it to 4 gigabytes. But uh, in doing that, it also uh, it can also cause my computer to crash. Um... CPU, I think it's a 3.8, uh, I want to say quad core, uh, GPU, it's, uh, it's 4 gigs, but again, uh, it's too much for my computer, originally it was, uh, it was a 2 gigabyte graphics card, but I'm here, turn the AC off, but, uh, when I bought the computer, it's like, um, uh, it was a pre-built, so all the components on it are just barely enough to support each other. So, like I said, when I put a new, uh, when I put a better graphics card in there, it now, my computer now crashes every so often. Um, these days, uh, starting up, starting up my OBS has a chance to crash my computer. Um, Idol Champions of the Forgotten Realms can also crash it. It's made up. Uh, it's made my computer very unstable. What's up? Uh, what's a 970? I think yours is uh, more powerful than mine. It says 11 gigabytes here. Yep, pretty much. Oh, four gigs. Um. Okay, so you got two fans on this one. Yeah, I only got one. Uh, your RAM size is 11 gigs. Yeah, it. Like I said, mine's only a four. Um. Based on that, I think I said a few minutes ago, I could probably play it, but I wouldn't be able to stream it. Well, I guess since I'm here, let me, uh, let me pull something up. Find it. There it is. Yeah, 
8 gigs of RAM, uh, 3.8 uh, quad core. Okay, I see it here. Mine's a, it's a Radon 560. Yours is a 970. Like I said, um, best case scenario, I could probably play it, but not stream it. Once again, the the new graphics card is too much for the rest of my computer to handle. And then, um, that's also uh, that's also assuming that uh, Pinball FX, Pinball M, will be able to consistently play on my computer, because. FX3 here, it still crashes from time to time. I'm on a... Right now, I'm on this uh, long string of good luck where it actually works. But that's not always the case. Sometimes I'll go for... Um, I'll have long stretches where FX3 crashes like right on startup. So... Yeah. Oh, and uh, welcome to the stream, Pinball. I forgot to say that earlier. Yeah, if um, most of the time, if I'm able to play something, I'd uh, I'd want to stream it. All right, where are we? not use the nerd gas I think I've only watched maybe a little tiny bit of this show it just kind of went in one eye and out the other I'm ran out. Go thwart something. Oh, 
Nirvana. Talk to me. What are you doing? Oh, okay. for seriously? Yeah, I, I couldn't tell which one they were saying, either nerd gas or nerve gas. You know, I bet there's a lesson to be learned from all this. Oh, technically I beat my previous. Okay, can't do this one. Copyrighted music. Copyrighted music turned off, but uh, then and then that that just leads to having the tables being uh, nerve-wracking as hell, cause you're having to deal with total silence. What's wrong? Pull yourself together. We can't afford mistakes like this. Careful. Pinball Arcade, when I played uh, Getaway on there, it has, uh, YouTube has copyright claimed my video when I exported it, so just base it on that. Nothing lasts forever. Oh, that was one ball. Okay. Yeah. And then, um, Harley Davidson, same thing. And I, I think I know what you're talking about on that, too, because on both Getaway, Harley Davidson, I mean, it's it's digitized, what, 8, 16-bit music? I mean, it, it sounds all kinds of bad. It's just... Blah, 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 And I, you can still export that video to YouTube, and it'll still get copyright claimed. So... Yeah, I can't can't play Mustang, or I probably could. The problem is, is I can only play one single mode on that table. All the other modes have copyrighted music, and it is the full blown actual music, not like the digitized versions. Roadshow, I have to do it on arcade, and I have to do it on here as well. When um when you get full blown multi ball, or I should say post jackpot multi ball, I have to kill the music, cause um FX3 doesn't didn't get the memo every little thing about you is still copyrighted so it'll play it anyway but yeah ghostbusters um i have to yeah i can't play that one i think it's uh yeah it's the full-blown music soundtrack and on top of that it's also a uh, fairly graphics intensive so it kind of jams up my stream because of all the graphical stuff going on and then acdc I don't have that like at all. I think one of my uh, one of my PS4, like Stern Pinball Arcade or something like that has it, but.
Sayonara. Welcome to the Sacho Sam. It's popcorn time. You have earned the Sacho Marble. Should be frenzy. So much for that. Get that bumper. Nope. nope. Yeah, that's another one has the exact replica. Where Alduin went, Dovahkiin. Yes. 
One of his allies could tell us. But it will not be easy to convince one of them to betray him. Perhaps the palace in White Run, Dragon's Reach. It was originally built to house a captive Dova. A fine place to trap one of Old Wind's allies. There is one who I remember well. Old Aving. He's the one to tell Oh my freaking god. Old Wind has gone. Visit the watchtower. Yeah, that's not annoying. We need to find out where Old Wind went, Dovahkeen. Yes. One of his allies could tell us, but it will not be easy to convince one of them to betray him. Perhaps the palace in White Run, Dragon's Reach. It was originally built to house a captive Dova. A fine place to trap one of Old Wind's allies. Oh. There is one. I really should keep these short and sweet. Remember well. Old Aving. He's the one to tell us where Old Wind has gone. So, I guess it mostly use that upper flipper like a baseball bat. He will not resist the challenge of your voice, Dover King. He will come. Now, hear his name. I think that you played this before, oh, or the actual Skyrim game. Do they actually talk this much in a Skyrim, the actual game? You will never set foot in Skull Dolphin. Of course, I could fly you there, but not while imprisoned like this. It's like, man, I'm, I could have completed the wizard mall by the time he got finished with that voice line. It's like, um... Oh, okay, okay. It's like it's like Legacy of Kane. It's like all the voice like all the voice lines on there like take forever. It's like you're listening to Atlas Schwag or something. To see the world 
out as only a Dover can. I warn you. Ooh, multi ball. Um, skies of Jesus. Actually, your envy of the Dove will only increase. Actually, you know what? Um, actually, what I'm going to do is since the, this next part, this next quest is multi-ball, it's going to sound crazy, but I'm going to go ahead and kill it right here. Reason being is, um, yeah. Now I'm assuming it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna save, it save my progress from that previous, that the previous uh, version. I want to see if it, or let me back up. I would like to think that it's gonna carry over into this version. Oh, yeah. Turn the right, turn the right. Yep, love the flippers. Or I should say, love the buttons. Unexpected. Skill increased. Gained a new ability. Cool. 
Cool. And I don't... All right. Well, good meeting you, man. Yeah, thanks for dropping by. Yeah, you take care, man. Yeah, I, I called it. So Skyrim. <laughs> Actually, um, uh, I'm gonna. So, I'm gonna go ahead and take him at his word. So, I think he was saying that uh, I should be okay with this music. But uh, I... This is only um, a one ball mode. So, if my video does get copyright claimed, I won't have to... I won't have to edit out very much. You're meddling with pirates you cannot possibly comprehend. So again, this way, if uh, if this video does get, or if, if my stream video does get copyright claimed, it's only going to be for like a little tiny bit. Something like that, I can just go ahead and um, I can have YouTube, they'll remove just that music, but leave all the other sound. Appreciate you guys coming on. Stand beside me, Phoenix, or suffer the fate of all traitors to Homo Superior. Cyclops! Help! Don't you see, Gene? My way. Well, so much for that. Way. Oh, I got out. I'll save.
Cerebro is ready, Professor. I need your help to complete the side scan. No. Aim to the left, the ramp. Uh, bumpers, I believe. Good luck with that one. The bumpers are in kind of a bad position. Yeah, bumpers keep getting in the way. Don't want that. Um, if you can, if you can see the little blue, blue uh, buttons. Yeah, you don't want to start that mode because it's gonna require you doing skill shots over and over. It's especially bad on a time mode. You may just as well pack it up at that point. Oh, I was one ball. I know. I'm a failure. Get a huge score just off the skill shot. What are those creatures doing? Still can't do it. Last chance. What are those creatures doing? There we go. Hey, that was nice. That spinner is getting in the way over there. Great. How lucky can you get? Thousands of years ago, these hunters taught For the last time, they're not my friends. We built this pyramid for them? Seems so. Now your friends use people to breed these creatures. For the last time, they are not my friends. This is the end for us. Whoa, this is tournament version. gonna be a bitch to hold on to the ball. She 
you can skip this. Jeez. Like I said, this is tournament version. Hurry up. Wish you could skip this. Surprisingly, Another. Yeah, not gonna be able to do this one. There's a timer bug. The the timer will freeze at some point. I don't think there is. 
Wait, Batman is uh Batman is DC, right? Okay. Yeah, cuz Yeah, cuz what they got on here is Marvel. And uh, I I can't really think of a uh, anything out there that has both Marvel and DC on the same game or the same show or whatever. It's usually one or the other. The closest I'd... The closest I'd probably have would either be like Spider-Man or Captain America. Even for the uh, left ramp. There's one back there. That was there. An adventure begins. Hurry up. No, 
idea where the Earth build is. Flipper, bitch. Treasure. Same line. So apparently that's where um uh, that's where I have to shoot that flashing red ramp. Long time no see, man. I know. I'm a failure. <laughs> Trying to lighten the load, huh? Are you um, you still playing gems? <laughs> that deserves a. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm, um... I only play on a very limited basis on there now. I don't stream it anymore. But, um... I'll go on it just, like, long enough to do dailies and stuff. Attack. Um. Just a second. Yeah. Personal joke, and I we go back a while. Um. We've been playing um. We've been playing Gems of War for years. In fact, way back in the day, I was actually in one of its. I was actually in his guild. It's a long time ago. I think so. So I now that I'm not now that I'm on the subject tack, I mean I mean PJ and I we've known each other for a very long time. Uh white women, in case um in case you didn't know, we both known each other for a very long time. I think um I think we knew each other almost right when I started streaming, which was like around eight years ago. Um Kitaro87, for the very rare time he comes on these days, same thing, so. And then yesterday, um, he's named Jay Notlaps these days, but his real name is Jay Hotlaps. Same thing, we've known each other for, we've known each other for a very long time. Years, I think. I've done good on this table before. <sighs> yeah, no. Yeah, and PJ, I'm in a I'm in a new guild. It's a, it's a more hardcore guild. Uh, stricter requirements. And I tell you what, this is gonna, this is gonna be it for the FX3 part of the stream, so I'll go ahead and kill it here. Yeah, that's the, that's still the same guild. Yeah, they got they got stricter requirements. Um, they actually want you to participate in uh, guild events, but um, since I don't play that, I play hardly at all anymore. I can't be a uh, I can't be as balls deep in the guild events as everybody else. Starting to starting to run low on gems. The waypoint.
going back home, huh? Yeah. It's... I think it's also one of the reasons why I don't... I don't play as much. I mean, a lot of the... A lot of the shit they're adding these days, it just... I'm almost... Required... To spend gems, um... Underspire comes to mind. I can't remember what they were originally, but I don't recall me having to spend a bunch of gems just to make the uh, battles uh, feasible. And then DJ Screw, if you remember him, we used to talk about um. We we're always saying we we're always saying to each other, <laughs> "Good thing we completed the tri completed the trials when we did." He still pops in once in a great while. But I don't I don't think he's a pinball guy, so <laughs> Yeah, um Oh, what's her face? Her name's on the tip of my tongue. Yankee Call. I think she no longer plays. I mean, Screw said she'll probably come back. I think she's done that before. Space Cadet. Um, never seen a... I've never heard of that one. Silver Ball. But yeah, anyway, I gotta I gotta break off for a bit. I I gotta get on my feet. I gotta get off my uh, back and off my knees. So Yeah, they they can't quite take me out sitting on the floor anymore. Good seeing you, but uh, I'm gonna. All right, but I am gonna throw a throw a video on. Um... That's what I'm going to be doing now. Get me something to eat, so. I wish I could remember what a pinball table a Baragon showed me. Trying to find something. Yeah. 
Ace high. Whoa, how old is this? Just gonna go ahead and throw this on. Um, I think this is the table that Paragon was talking about earlier. Paragon or one of y'all. Set up, got to throw my uh, cell phone on the charger. Anyway, I'll be back. Sucker, it's quiet. High, 1957. Gottlieb dominated the pinball industry during the 50s and 60s, producing over 200 different tables. Gottlieb was well known for its sports theme, fantasy, casino, and playing card themed tables like Ace High during this era. When this game was still in arcades, good players would accumulate replays and sell them to the arcade owner. And, this of banning and then, um, in several states. Yeah, like I said, this is just a short video. Um, I don't want to spend all night trying to find a find a walker one, uh, or at least one where they're not they're not flapping their gums the whole time. It's annoying.
This guy ought to nudge. During the 50s and 60s, producing over 200 different tables, Gottlieb was well known for its sports theme, fantasy, casino, and playing card theme tables like Ace High during this era. When this game was still in arcades, good players would accumulate replays and sell them back to the arcade owner. This led to banning replays in several states. Yeah. Man, it's like I said, too, he, he needs to start nudging. Tables like this, uh, Central Park, to a lesser extent, um, Xenon. Yeah, it's pretty much a, it's pretty much a pachinko, or a pachinko machine with flippers. A good chunk of uh, Zacharias tables are like this too. Well, oh, call it good there. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and start um I'm gonna go ahead and start transitioning over to Pinball Arcade. Oh, 
Oh, also, um, the moment I can uh, get control of the ball, I gotta explain something on here. But when you hear me say double flipper, bitch, it was, uh, I think the term was coined by a pinball legend named Bowen Cairns. Um, and this table is a classic example of it. His, the original definition was, uh, if you could see the uh, two lower flippers over here, well, if you mistimed your flip, you know, you got a little too hasty, and when the ball just kind of squirts right between them, that's a double flipper, bitch. I've extended that definition to also include these uh, two main flippers here. Like, uh, if the ball's coming down and I make the mistake of popping both of them up at the same time, which you really shouldn't be doing. I mean, pinball 101 right there. But if, if doing that caused the ball to go straight down straight down between them, I call that a double flipper bitch as well. So, it's one of the most fundamental errors you can do in pinball. Because, again, this is a big no-no right here. Hitting both flippers at the same time. But, I've had it since childhood. It's, it's a habit that I just can't seem to get rid of. So, uh-oh. Boy, you're just chock full of these, aren't you? Gosh, heck, video game. So are you getting, um, you're getting these emotes from, like, other streamers, right? Take a look at that. HCO, HCO. Okay. Wow, okay. I never knew you. didn't know you've been on for that long. So you're around back what uh when it was called Justin TV then. You're old school. I wish I was. Oh, that's right. Um, speed running was pretty much in its infancy back then too. Quit talking and start chalking. I think um, I want to say uh, Cosmo was um uh, one of the earliest speed runners. Thank you. 
like a bad gum. That's an extra ball. Holy shit, you go back a while. <gasps> so, you mean like you you were actually there, right? What a sea ball horse. split it so he let me set on Okay. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. Take the bank shot. More for wizard. Finally. Yeah, speaking of that, I was trying to make a I was trying to make a double flipper bitch. Um emote. Yeah, it wasn't happening. Um for one, a good chunk of the, the flipper images are actually uh they're they're actually owned by uh, like Photo Bucket and Alame and all them. So yeah, fuck that. And then um the ones I could find they're, um, a lot of them are arranged, like, they look like this, or they're, they're all messed up. I can't, I have to have it, I have to have, like, like, actually sitting like this. But again, a bunch of them are, like, and then sometimes you got the ball that's kind of, like, in the way and stuff. So, I still look from time to time, but no dice. No way, round. No way. Shoot the white target. And... Somehow, this game can differentiate between, uh, like that, the cue ball. It, it somehow detects the difference. Mm. Mm. 
I've thought of that too. Um, I think there's a there's like a one megabyte limit on the emotes. Even when um, uh, even when making the limp dick one, it was, I think the original was actually over uh, was over one megabyte. So I had a I had to shrink it down even further. Combo for me. What kind of help I shot with that? Oh, I'll still ball one. I won't hit a single one. Well, Hit the ball up the ramp layer. Okay, I see what you mean. I see what you mean. I'm kind of split the load. Okay. What is that? Oh, I see what... Okay. Two different uh, emotes put together in one. Maybe it's nostalgia. Nice Recalling all those old days with you and the speedrunners and stuff. Okay, baby. Got another extra ball.
what I wanted to. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know a lot of the voice lines on here. It's just easier. You got solid. I mean, you could. If you shoot. Take the bank shot. If you shoot the ball in the far left hole here, it's always going to come out this way. Um, you got solid. Shoot the ball up in here, saucer up here. It's always going to pop it out the same way, so it just. Keep the corner uh, Ball trajectories are a lot more predictable on this. Wizard gets you. Um, you can just keep hitting the uh, center horseshoe, and you get like a bunch of extra points. Like I can't remember what, but that's all it is. to get in the corner pocket is on accident. up. Oh, 
Well, so much for that. Yahoo! Time's up. Hitting that white target with a cue ball doesn't count. No idea how the hell they have I don't think in real life, a pinball table's got to be able to differentiate between a hit from a pinball and a, and a cue ball. I think this this table came out um, years before uh, King of the Hill did. Actually, let me look. 1992. It's actually, I think it probably came out before even uh, Beavis and Butthead did. I might be wrong on that, though. Just yeah, this is one of those I'll um, tilt the table intentionally just to skip the uh, end of ball crap. That's what you want. That's my skill shot right there. Oh, get out! Oh, I did say it. Kind of a mandatory shot. Of course, it doesn't mean shit when the ball goes straight down the middle afterwards. Too much. Need that ramp shot. There we go. The storm is coming. Oh wow, okay. I didn't know that I didn't know that's oh, excuse me. I didn't know that started up multi ball too. Oh, 
goes one. And the other. Really? Yep. Yeah, just kill it. Just kill it. So I can get the ball back quicker. down the middle. Was almost a double flipper, bitch. Is that your good backhand? Apparently not. And down it goes. It. There we go. Again, so I. It's this is so I can get the ball back quicker. my skill shot right there. Oh, almost double flipper bitched it. So, eventually, if you can hit, if you can hit the right ramp enough times, if you can hit the right ramp enough times to where you have 99 Skyway tokens or whatever they're called, every subsequent right ramp you hit after that is going to get you a 200,000 uh, end of the world bonus. Earthshaker has that same thing as well. That was ball three. No, it is now. Nope, almost. The storm is coming. Nope.
There we go. Well, there goes one. Right off the bat. No multi ball or no ball save on this table. Hope I can backhand this. There we go. right by me. So much for that. God fucking damn it! You guys ready? Yeah. That was a quick, that was a quick one. I already played this one. You just crossed over into the Twilight Zone. Yeah, this is the, what's so fucking great about this table again? Tight table. You unlock this door with the key of imagination.
right. I gotta hit the arm. Greed. Get big or higher. Give me Twilight Zone. Wait, is that multi ball? Yeah, that's multi ball. I don't know that. And there goes one. I can do so, so much for that in the back right corner of the table um, extra balls lit yeah I don't know how well you can see it but I don't think he can. I don't think he can skip the um uh, and the ball crap. And I'm trying to hit the uh, far right loop right there. What's so great about this table again? It's a tilt bug. Well, I guess you can't skip it. Kinda. Ate my input. by me.
gonna do? Look at Twilight Zone. Can't seem to hit it. So, no luck. Nope, no luck for me. Oh, sure, I get in there now. Beyond this door is a dimension of sight. Oh, that don't happen often. One's supposed to do that. I'm trying to hit the uh Stay with the devil at your own risk in the twilight zone. Why with me? Oh wait, that was all. Uh... Yeah, my best still ain't good enough. Yeah, that yellow hole. Yeah, mandatory shot. <laughs> yeah, that didn't last long. Double flipper, bitch. Yeah, multi ball. Um, left ramp. I, not that, but you will have to shoot that later. But oh, and there's there's also a big magnet in the center of the table too. It's gonna really make a mess of things. so much for that. Of 
course, I'm not going to hit it. Yeah, so, show's over. Here's another explosion. Explosion for your movie, kid. Well, that didn't last long. Check that one. Game's lagging. I idea where that is. Get up.
Left hand starting to hurt. I'm not gonna be on much longer. Hey, yo! Boom! Extra balls lit. Oh yeah, that's kind of a pointless extra ball on this table. They're only on the alt lanes. Oh, we can call it an extra. We can call it an extra ball. It's just a glorified ball save. Forgot about that. Hey, There you go. You sir and you madam. Round and round she goes. We, we have, have a winner. winner. Usually stops right on 200, either 200k or zilch. I can't remember if that was ball two or ball three. Damn it. Okay. Good thing I good thing I checked. Or I should say, good thing I waited. That was ball three, though. One of my all-time faves, Central Park. <sighs> yeah, definitely got to be cutting it short here pretty soon. Or, let me back up. Definitely got to be cutting it short here. up so I guess we can call this a flipper bitch I mean only one flipper and you miss time but flip and then whoop, ball squirts right underneath don't think I'll be lasting long on here That's where you don't want the ball to go. The the two on the lower left or the two on the lower right. It, the ball has to drain. You want it to drain on the middle too.
Botched it. Uh, El Dorado, I think. Yeah. Oh, another fave. Also a good table for beginners too. down the middle. And now the back's chiming in. I was about to say, it's okay to, it's definitely okay to tilt. It's definitely okay to tilt on this table. There is no end of ball bonus on this, so you're not losing out on anything. Hey, let's party. Hey, let's party. Gonna, gonna have a strawberry. Game's lagging. Specials count as extra balls on this one. Oh. And then for multi-ball, I think it said it. Hit both ramps, and you'll get jackpot. There on after, each ramp gives you a big chunk of points. There's one. Got to hit the left one. Got it. Oh. 
Yeah. Double flipper, bitch. And it goes down there anyway. How about another bomb? Now, otherwise, in order to in order to light the locks, you have to take down the upper rollovers, or light them up, I should say. Just tilt it. That was input lag. I knew I had that. Right, that was ball three. I'm out of there. It's a beautiful day on the farm. Stream might lag some on this. This table's fairly graphics intensive. Holy shit, is this table lagging? Oh. I guess that was a tilt, but yeah, I... No. No, the table's lagging way too much. I already played this one. You've just crossed over I already played this one too. To the twilight zone. I am in your control. And 
depending on how long man depending on how long I last on this table this might be my last one left ramp. Damn it. Trying to keep the ball from going in there. Most, but not quite. Oh, so much for that. Dirty pool. Dirty pool.
And I fucked it off afterwards. I'm to fuck it up right now. Damn, I sure yeah. took a while. Yeah. Sure had a lot of extra balls, too. Maybe one more. Help me. Help me. Adam. i 
Cuidado. If you can see that yellow spot target on the right, right next to the upper flipper, that's what I'm aiming for. Because uh, that, it uh, upgrades the spinner, which is, which is going to be your main target on this table. And, um, multi-ball is possible, as you probably saw. Lock a ball here and here. But, uh, in order to... In order to release that ball from multi-ball, you have to smack three drop targets, which... Not really worth it. Um, just like Black Knight, having two-ball multi-ball, scores are doubled. Three-ball multi-ball, scores are tripled. But, again, getting to that point is a major pain in the ass. You're better off just making your, uh, default shot the spinner shot, especially if you can get it lit. Nope. And a double flipper bitched it. I wasn't expecting that. that ball three Help um we got some table bugging going on never seen this before Adam. yeah I mean if you lock a ball you're not supposed to lose a ball so yeah a bit of an issue there That's definitely ain't good enough on this table. Whoa. So, yeah, I'll just go ahead and call it off here. Um, like I said, my left hand is already starting to hurt, especially around... Especially around this area here, so definitely gotta lay off a bit. Uh, still gotta, still gotta get my, still have to get going on my post-production stuff. I got a feeling I got a fair amount to do on it. Um, a fair amount has happened this stream. 
Still need to get going on my Gem to War uh, session as well. It's a brand new week, so there's a whole, there's a whole lot of new stuff I gotta get taken care of on that. That um, and I probably have a shit ton of stuff I gotta type down for my blog. Like I said, this is a pretty eventful stream. Um, a fair amount has happened, so I've got a lot to type down on my blog, like I just said. So, but otherwise, hey, thanks for dropping in and hanging off me, everybody. I appreciate that. And, um, I should be on again tonight. My default time is 9 p.m. And that is U.S. Central. Until then, thanks again for coming by, everybody, and I'll see you all next time.